Kangaroo, Japanese, Kangaroo is an arcade platform game that was released in 1982. It was manufactured by Sun Electronics and distributed by Atari. Kangaroo is one of the first arcade games similar in style to Donkey Kong without being a direct knock-off. The player takes the role of a boxing glove wearing Mother Kangaroo who is trying to rescue her child from fruit-throwing monkeys. Despite featuring jumping, there is no jump button. Instead, the player pushes up on the joystick or up and diagonally to jump. Topic: <laughs> Gameplay. There are 4 different levels. Each of them consist of the mother kangaroo on the bottom floor trying to reach the top floor where her joey is being held captive by some monkeys. On each of the levels, there are monkeys who are throwing apples at the mother kangaroo. Sometimes the apples are thrown so that she must jump over them and sometimes they are thrown so that she must duck. If she gets face to face with one of the monkeys, she can punch the monkey with a boxing glove. She can also punch and destroy apples if they're thrown in level with her gloves. Also, there are pieces of fruit that she can jump up and get for points. Additionally, there is at least one bell on each level that she can hit so that more fruits will appear. She must be wary of the big ape, who will occasionally appear and try to take her gloves away from her. The level must be completed before the time runs out, otherwise the player will lose a life. Levels 1, 2 and 4 consist of different platforms that the mother kangaroo must jump onto or climb onto via a ladder. On the third level, the cage in which the kid kangaroo is imprisoned is held up by an entire troop of monkeys and there is a horde of apples that the monkey will unleash if five of them climb up there. On this level, the mother kangaroo must punch each monkey in the stack several times until the cage is lowered and when the cage has been lowered enough, the mother kangaroo must climb to the next floor to get to the kid kangaroo before the cage is raised again or before the monkeys have an avalanche of apple cores unleashed. Kangaroo has a number of clearly visible glitches in the graphics, such as sprites briefly flickering. The game uses popular classical and folk songs for background music, including American Patrol by F. W. Meacham used during regular gameplay, Oh, Susanna by Stephen Foster used as level completion fanfare, and Westminster Quarters used when a bell is rung. Ports Kangaroo was ported to the Atari 2600, Atari 5200, and Atari 8-bit family. The Atari 8-bit version was published through the Atari Program Exchange, which is unusual, as APX was created to publish user-designed software, not licensed ports. Reception. Arcade Express gave the arcade version an 8 out of 10 in November 1982. The Atari 5200 version of Kangaroo was later reviewed by Video Magazine in its ''Arcade Alley'' column where it received mixed commentary. While describing the game as ''an excellent piece of work'', reviewers also admitted that it had ''fail ed to bowl them over'' and criticized the game's ''animation quality graphics'' which appeared to be used primarily to «dress up rudimentary play action». It was later awarded «1984 Best Arcade to Home Video Game, Computer Game Translation» at the 5th Annual Archie Awards, where judges noted that «all aspects of the game look and play» as a «virtual duplicate». Of the arcade version, four reviewers in a 1997 issue of Digital Press gave the Atari 5200 version 5, 7, 8, and 5 all out of 10. Television adaptation In 1984, Kangaroo and Space Ace replaced Pitfall Harry, Frogger, and Donkey Kong Jr. as segments on CBS's Saturday Supercade cartoon lineup. The basic plot line involves Kangaroos named Katie voiced by Maya Martineau and Joey voiced by David Mendenhall, who lives in a zoo run by the zookeeper Mr. Friendly voiced by Arthur Berghardt and are good friends with Sidney the Squirrel voiced by Marvin Kaplan. Katie and Joey would often thwart the plots of the mischievous Monkeybiz gang voiced by Pat Fraley and Frank Welker consisting of Bingo, Bongo, Bongo, and Fred. 
The monkey biz gang caused trouble by trying to escape from the zoo and Katie would have to help keep them in line. The series has never been officially released on DVD or VHS in any form.